like the things you see on Facebook. Alright. Just to entertain, I'm going to give it a shot. Check it out. See what's going on. Saturday, May 30th, 2020, a live feed was aired by news and government outlets showing SpaceX and NASA collaborating to launch two astronauts, Bob Benkin and Doug Hurley, into orbit to join the International Space Station. The launch finally took place at the Launch Complex 39A in Florida after a weather delay on May 27th, three days earlier. Many viewers noticed a small rodent crawling across the Merlin engine during the broadcast. While that sounds cute in itself, the moment this rodent made his live TV appearance was after the rocket carrying the two astronauts had achieved an altitude of 200 kilometers, which is approximately 124 miles high. And the craft was traveling 13,000 kilometers per hour, which is 8,000 miles an hour, or Mach 10. The rodent moving around on the engine metal was seemingly unaffected by the immense speed, air friction, extreme temperatures, or lack of oxygen. Saturday's footage leaves many clear-thinking scientists and physicists to question the validity of these claims in media productions. A mouse shouldn't be casually walking across the metal engine of a craft, supposedly traveling at Mach 10 with no breathable air. Are these launches real? Tell us what you think. For this and other news, visit www. Okay. <laughs> it really did look like a rat. Uh, I just want to be totally sure. So let's go to like the real feed of like the actual feed of NASA, their video. Because I did watch the launch. I don't think I've seen anything like that. Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention. So let's go check out the actual feed here. Okay, so... As you can see, this is NASA's feed. This is about the position he was talking about. Um, so we're just going to watch it and see what we the see stage here. stage booster coming back towards our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. We're about a minute away from entry burn. That second there is debris falling, the but into orbit. I don't think and it's. If you're keeping an eye on that timer, that's going to continue to burn. <laughs> Holy crap, crap dude! So a little... No way! Oh my god! <laughs> what do you guys think? You think that's real? <laughs> oh my gosh, dude! Now I am. A huge SpaceX fan and a space fan that is, if that and uh, yeah, I didn't see that in the first or when I watched the live feed of it. Oh my goodness, guys! Well, I think it might have just been debris that kind of was shaped like you know you can't really tell that it's a rat in there. It may have been just debris and. You know, because there was debris falling besides whatever that was, whether it be, it's not going to be a rat. You can't breathe in space. A rat's not going to be able to breathe in space. It's ridiculous. Comment your thoughts. Let me know what you think. I thought this was a pretty good, I thought it was pretty funny, uh, pretty wild, um, you know, conspiracy video. I guess you, I guess that's what you would say it would be. Uh, shout out to New Jer Wait, what does that say? New Jerus Jerusalem Media. I'm sorry if I butchered that name up super bad. 372 subscribers. You could check him out. He, I've read through some of his comments, and they're quite amusing, to say the least. But uh, tell me what you guys think. Uh, honestly, I think it was just debris, and because they're traveling like what Mach uh, Mach ten or something like that. I honestly don't think that was a rat. <laughs> Could you imagine if it was though? <laughs> like they had this huge production 
I'm trying to get to space and a rat ruins it. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't think that was a rat. I thought it was a. Uh, I thought it was a pretty funny video though, and so I had to share it with you guys. Again, tell me what you think in the comments. I thought it was pretty cool, pretty funny, pretty cool video to make. So yeah, if you're new here, you want to see more videos like this, just hit that subscribe button. I'm a pretty funny guy, I think so anyway. And we got a lot of other stuff on the channel too, like I got some car related content, a bunch of vlogs and stuff like that. It's just some cool stuff. Thanks again for all the new subscriptions and the past recent month or so and glad you enjoyed the videos and i'm out peace <laughs> see you guys